Hi, welcome to another Natterbox tutorial. In this tutorial, I will show you how to receive a call and what options become available then. First, make sure you are logged into Salesforce and the web phone is loaded as shown in a previous tutorial. Next, select your availability in the drop down menu. These will be different depending on your organization and what the administrator has set up for you. These can be different call groups like support, sales, etc. or even availability states like ready, on lunch or busy for example. In my example, I have set up two groups, EMEA and Americas. And for this example, I have set myself ready to take calls from the EMEA region and I'll now minimize the CTI. Now let's see how the CTI changes when a call comes in. As you can see, the CTI immediately jumps into view when a call is coming in. Here you get the option to answer by clicking the green button, or reject the call by clicking the red button. Also you will see the caller's number displayed and the contact and account will also display if this is a previously known contact within Salesforce. Let's answer the call. Now that I have answered the call, three new icons are displayed. Namely a speaker icon to represent the volume of the call, a microphone icon to show the volume of your microphone, as well as a thumbs up icon that shows the signal quality. Furthermore, we have a link to current item button in the middle of the CTI. Normally, any activity logged for this call will be associated with the Salesforce record of the incoming caller, providing they have previously been logged in Salesforce. But if the activity needs to be associated with a different record, simply search for that record and click link to current item. Now the activity will be saved with this record. The notes can later be viewed either as an activity under the object that the item was linked to, or in the Recent tab under Activity on your CTI, as seen here. Once you have completed a call, you can hang up. And select the appropriate wrap-up code. Wrap-up codes summarize what the outcome of the call was. These displayed here are just an example and may be defined differently by your administrator. Finish by clicking Log Call. 